Well, I've started doing the um, just doing the card strips for the scenery on this side uh, for the embankment. I put a, I put a couple of card bits, thick, you know, corrugated cardboard bits in there just to uh, keep the profile out a bit because I've had to make it a special bit around the around the hut. But uh, it's all sort of glued glued it top and bottom. But I've run out of cereal packet card now, so I'll have to wait until sort of. Uh, breakfast time tomorrow then there should be another empty box so I can nick the card from it and this is it from the other side um, as you can see a lot of work to do um, I'm only going uh, as you saw in the previous video I'm only going to size here because I've still got to I've got to put the platforms in before I can do any any much any much uh, more to this um, then I'll get the platforms in get then I get the right height for the road coming down but I can concentrate on this bit and get this bit done anyway so that'll take me a little while to do so that's it so far, I have to do it from track level that's how it's going to look when it's all blended in with the bridge and everything else so yeah, that's it so far anyway well, I've done the lattice structure now on the uh, scenery um, I'm now going to put the first layer of uh, uh, tissue paper, well, kitchen roll and uh, watered down PVA glue, put the first coat on it on it at least well, I'm going to try and get the first three uh, coats all the way through I've only done as far as here because I'm not finished this but I'm just going to do it as I go along um, so that's that's my job uh, for this evening. This is the first three layers of kitchen roll and watered down PVA glue put on. I'm going to leave this now overnight to dry, possibly a bit longer, and then I'll uh, do a layer of neat PVA glue over the top of it, leave that to dry, and then do another three layers of kitchen roll. By, by the time I've gone away over it with quite a few more layers, um, you'll lose the sort of where you can see like the card strips. You'll, you'll, that'll gradually go. So. Um, this is a view down uh, the cutting now with the you know, cutting side on and uh, yeah quite happy with it so far it's looking all right well that's the uh, that's the the uh, cutting side done on that side uh, just done the uh, sort of brown brown ground cover um, so that's as far as I've got now that's as far as I can do now because uh, I need to get the platforms in before I can do any more another little bit I did is I've done this little piece here on the side of the yard where the gate is um, that's been done painted I've just I've already just painted that but uh, that's the entrance to the goods yard there with the gate I managed to get a bit of paint on the gate but I'll, I'll give that a coat of paint anyway paint it up uh, shortly but yeah that's it that's now all I can do till I get the platforms in but uh, quite happy with the progress I've got anyway so what I'm going to do I'm going to mix this from the end of this from this shot to the original how the line is now uh, thank you very very much for you uh, for watching this and uh, feel free to subscribe and I'll do some more updates as and when I get some more work done I don't know when that will be though because as I say I've got to get the uh, the platforms in next before I do any more scenery so anyway yeah I'm going to finish this with mixing from the model uh, into the original uh, location looking in this uh, direction 